Hey everybody, how's it going? Hey, we've got Jim here tonight in the studio since we've been uh, trying to get this thing straightened out. Thought I'd do, uh, do a little test tonight and give you some information since I'm sitting here tinkering around. Might as well kill two birds with one stone. Um, welcome to Racers and Rods TV. Uh, one of the first episodes here. We want to get you up to date on a bunch of the shows we've got coming basically through October. Uh, because there's a lot of stuff coming up now that the weather hopefully is going to get a little bit cooler, stop raining every day and that sort of thing, get back in the swing of things here in September and October. Got one of my, uh, one of my show hats on here. If you've been out to any of the shows, um, my, uh, my, uh, my, my hairdo here sticks out a little bit and, uh, these actually match my, my real hair pretty darn, darn well. So this is one I don't wear very much out at the shows, but, uh, give you a little taste of that tonight. So without further ado, let me run through some of the um, events that uh, are going on starting this weekend um, in in the, the mid end of August here and through September and actually through October. So we're going to get a whole bunch of these. We're going to put some graphics up on the screen here. Uh, you'll be able to see those and then we'll try to link all of the Facebook events, that sort of thing, or the website events uh down below so you'll be able to get to all of those if uh if you're interested in any any of the shows so starting off with this weekend sunday uh the 18th cars and bowling at bolero in sarasota um our guys from the, the detail guys uh gonna head, go ahead and put that on free show starts at uh 6 p.m and uh the, like i said that's gonna be free free bowling afterwards too so that's pretty cool um racers and rods may make an appearance there you you never know um since it's kind of in our neck of the woods we're trying to figure out what we're going to do here for the next couple weekends so we might be there and might be uh getting your car and your bowling skills on uh on video so uh polish up those uh uh those balls and be ready to rock so we'll see how that goes um next one is going to be the weekend after great show here by uh, ralphie rem events Cars and Armory. Can't say the word. It's on Facebook. They're going to kick us off of Facebook. Uh, if we say the G word, um, let's just say pew pew. Um, we'll, uh, we'll leave it at that. 9 a.m. Sunday, the 25th in Tampa. Um, Cars and Armory. Going to be a good event. Unfortunately, we can't make that. That has been postponed since uh, a couple weekends ago when that ridiculous storm Debbie rolled through and screwed up everything. And um, um, the shout out goes out to everyone here in the, in the Sarasota Bradenton and also north of us in those areas that have had flooding and had, um, um, you know, a bunch of bad stuff happen. So, um, hey, prayers go out to you. Hopefully everything's going to be OK and, um, you know, keep keep kicking. So uh, that's been rescheduled from a couple weeks ago. Unfortunately, I have a family event that day on the 25th. So, um we won't be there, but we'll be there in spirit. So check that one out. That's always a good event. Uh, Ralphie puts on some really cool stuff. So uh, one of the recurring events, Caffeine and Chrome, the last Saturday of the month, 9 a.m. Gateway Classic Cars and Ruskin. That one's always free. That's always a good show. Um, the Roman Oldies, uh, I believe, uh, come out there. Uh, the Pontiac Club comes out and does uh, sponsors that. And uh, if you have not been into uh, the building there at, uh, at Gateway Classic Cars, uh, you owe it to yourself to go in there. They do consignment of uh, some very cool vehicles. They usually have about 200 or so in the warehouse. And it's pretty cool to walk around. You can get close up and kind of see what's going on there. They've got a little bit of everything in there. Um, so that's always very cool. Um, one that, uh, that my buddy Paul is, uh, is putting on from Hydro FX. If you need uh, hydro dipping, uh, we're going to be doing a little feature, doing a little business feature on on hydro FX here, uh, probably in the next few weeks. Um, we can get you can get a hold of me, get a hold of Paul. Um, he's the man when it comes to uh, hydro dipping. Uh, they do a a monthly show at the Talking Pint, the last Saturday of the month, 11 a.m. in Riverview. That one's also free. Just kind of a cruise and get together. Cool place there too. You can get yourself a couple drinks, get some food and uh hang out with a bunch of cool car people so uh tell them racers and rod sent you we probably won't be at that because it's my daughter's birthday that day 
um, unfortunately, uh, well, for, fortunately for her, I guess. And, uh, you know, I got to show up at that. So, um, maybe next month. So we'll see, we'll see on that one. So, uh, next one's a bunch of great people too. Bradenton performance, uh, supply their, uh, second annual car show in, uh, on September 1st, 4 PM in Bradenton. They're out on state road 60. Uh, actually they're, they're off of state road 64. Uh, if you're from familiar with Bradenton Motorsports Park, kind of heading out that way, they're out there. They do a lot of support for the for the track there and everything uh, as far as performance supplies. Um, catch those out. A bunch of good people there. It's going to be their second annual show. Uh, again, that will be uh, September 1st at 4 p.m. So that'll be that'll be a fun one. We we may be at that one. Um, we're not sure yet. So we're going to try. Uh, let's see another one that, uh, a good friend of ours, Jordan is, is putting on, he does a bunch of great charity events. Um, we'll be there. We'll be, uh, kind of co-hosting a little bit. We'll be doing media. Um, I will also be acting DJ that day, uh, drive against darkness charity show, September, Saturday, September 7th at 11 AM. That'll be thunder Dodge Jeep Ram and Bartow. We will be there uh with uh with our cameras and uh so come out um for a good cause there have some vendors there and uh and and food so that'll be fun his shows are always pretty pretty good uh brings out a good crowd so um check that one out that'll be that'll be a lot of fun and, and again we'll be we'll be out there uh uh playing some tunes and also um um capturing the fun you know with our our, our media crew so um check that one out um this is one that 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 that, that this particular event but the group that puts this on uh the central florida street rod association if you've ever been to any of their shows we've been to a couple of their shows last year um they put on a really good event a lot of older old school hot rods but a lot of newer stuff too but mostly mostly older school stuff if you're into that which we are um really good show this is heroes and hot rods saturday saturday september 21st 10 a.m it's in lake alfred uh, which is kind of, uh, I guess a little bit more north, well, north of us, um, center of the state. So, uh, that's a good show. We're not sure whether we'll be there or not, but actually I will not because I'll be out of town. I'm, 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 I'll be out of town for two weeks. Uh, in September, I will be in the, uh, Richmond, Virginia area, uh, awaiting, um, another, uh, grandchild. So, uh, We'll see how that goes. Um, I'll be working up there and I actually found a really big car show in the area. So when I'm up there, I'm probably going to try to, if uh, the family allows, um, I'll, I'll skip out and, and try to catch that because that uh, looks like it's a, a good event um, in Spotsville, I believe. Uh, five, six hundred cars every year. So anyway, that'll be cool. Um, okay, so the next one is near and dear to my heart. We're back. Um, our hosted show, Steak and Shake Bradenton. Um, it's now, it was on the third Friday of the month. We'll now be on the first Friday of the month. We've, we've been taking a little hiatus to get things reset um, and, and, uh, and get out of the heat and, and rain of the summer. So uh, it'll be the, the first Friday of the month, October 4th. Um, we're going to try to step things up a little bit. We're going to bring in some vendors. We're going to do a feature car award every month. We give out some prizes. Um, Steak and Shake always gives us some, uh, some free, um, free shake coupons and, and some, some free food, you know, packages and things like that. So that's a free event. It's a cruise in. We're going to do that every month. Again, it'll be the first Friday of the month starting at six o'clock. We've got music there again. I will be your, uh, uh, pseudo DJ, um, something that I, I, I like to do, but it, but it doesn't allow me to get out from behind the, the table and check out the cars and meet everybody, um, as much as I like, but it's fun. So that's a great event. We love that. We love doing that. It's been very successful for the past, uh, oh, year or so. Um, and we've done very, we're kind of the, the OGs of the, um, uh, the cruise in at Steak and Shakes. I know it's becoming very popular. There's a few of them. Uh, one of the one in Brandon's doing very well. Uh, I think they're doing that actually every week on Friday night. So anyway, we'll be there first Friday of the month, October 4th. So check us out there. Uh, scroll the list here down a little bit. Uh, this will be one that we'll be at if you're interest in, interested in festivals. Uh, a little bit out of the way, maybe for most of you. 
Um, but we're going to be there. First annual Trash the Classics. It's Saturday and Sunday, October 5th and 6th. Starts at 10 a.m. every day. Uh, it's actually in Okeechobee, uh, which will be pretty cool. It's at the, the Civic Center or the Civic uh, uh, Area uh, Fair Area there, um, park, that sort of thing. And like I said, it's a festival. They have a car show. They're having vendors, craft vendors. They're having food vendors. Um, there's a beard contest. They'll have a pinup girl contest. They're having a tattoo contest. Uh, music throughout the weekend. So like I said, it's not only a car show. It's going to be a festival. Might be a little out of the way, but I think that's going to be a fun one. We'll be out there um, covering everything. And our buddies from uh, Rooster's Rod Shop. Well, actually, uh, we'll, uh, we'll also be out there. They'll have their uh, their hot rods there, their trailer, their merchandise, and that sort of thing. Um, we appreciate them. We appreciate everything they do for us, and, and we'll be out there uh, uh, hanging out with them and having a good time. So um, that'll be fun. Uh, a new one that's just come up again, uh, REM Events is, 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 uh, is stepping the game up here. This is one that... Uh, they were reached out uh, to from GTE, the GTE Family Motor Fest, 11 a.m. Saturday, October 12th um, at Steinbrenner Field, Steinbrenner Park in Tampa. Uh, I believe it's a free car show, free event. Um, you'll have to check the link out on that. That just came out today. Again, that's another REM events, uh, uh, Ralphie Martinez event. So. Um, um, he's, uh, he's stepping the game up. He's getting to be, um, uh, pretty well known in the car show, uh, promotion, uh, area around here. So good for him. So that's, that's going to be a fun event. Unfortunately, we can't be there that weekend. Uh, we have some other commitments, um, outside of, uh, outside of that. So, uh, check that out again. That's a free event. Um, another one, uh, that probably everyone, most everyone knows about. Uh, monthly event we haven't been to for a while. We've been trying to get back, um, but it's a it's an awesome event. Jack's Wax, um, their monthly free uh, car meet that brings out you know 500 cars every month, which is crazy. Um, Saturday morning, a or Sunday morning. I'm sorry, Sunday morning, 9 a.m. Sunday the 12th. Um, if you get there at nine o'clock, um, you'll be parking in the boonies. You got to get there early. Uh, our buddy DJ Brian's out there uh, doing what he does and, and stirring the pot. That's also a free event. Um, we appreciate everybody there too. That's that's always been a fun event, and they have been very very good to us. So um, the next one going into October, a big one for us, and and we appreciate these guys. We've been doing a lot of promotion for them. They're one of our sponsors. Um, Slam Fest 33 in Tampa, 30 33rd consecutive year for slam fest uh in tampa so one of the longest if not the longest running uh consecutive consecutively running car show uh in florida if not uh, uh um, the southeast I, I guess so um move in is october 18th it's the 19th and 20th saturday and sunday razors and rods will be uh be there along with mini trucking magazine and a whole bunch of other media outlets um we may actually be doing some paid possibly don't hold us to that but we've been talking to jonathan and minnie madness about maybe doing some paid photo shoots uh if you get there a lot of people get there on saturday or friday to stake out their their club area and get set up and that sort of thing so uh, if you're interested in getting some uh, photos of your vehicle some cool photos there at the fairgrounds will be will possibly be be doing that uh, miss slam fest contest uh pinup contest this year so uh uh, they're bringing that in. That'll be a lot of fun. So again, you know, tons inside and outside, probably what, maybe 50, 60, 70 cars inside the building. Um, you know, 600 cars outside. And the cool thing that we love about Slam Fest is that it's at the, you know, the state fairgrounds in Tampa. There's a lot of room there and they allow, um, without being crazy they allow everyone with the vehicles to um to cruise around so we get a bunch of really cool shots and videos of you know the guys coming by us um stuff scraping the ground stuff with hydraulics airbags the big trucks um you know we got some shots last year where uh 
uh, I thought, thought uh, my son Aaron might, uh, um, um, he was, let's say, you see, he was very close to some very large trucks, and I'm sure they did not see him on the ground where, where he was getting those. So we get some cool videos out there. That's a hell of a lot of fun. And we appreciate all of them for uh, allowing us to come in and do what we do there. So um, this is, uh, I guess, our third third year, at, at, at least officially at Slamfest. We've been there a couple more times. But anyway, won't be that in. But that's a good one. You need to be at that one. Um, that's, a, that's a lot of fun and, and a big show. Uh, the next one's another local one here that's, uh, that's, that's been good to us. Uh, Foxbrook Car Show. October 26th, um, it starts at, I believe, 9 a.m. It's in Parrish, uh, which is uh, in Manatee County, um, just south of the, the Hillsborough County line. It's kind of, uh, east, of uh, east of the interstate. It's at a really cool church there, a really big place. It's all free. Um, Michael and the guys that put this on, very, very great, good bunch of people. This brings out a lot of cool cars. It brings out a lot of street rods, a lot of cool stuff in the area. And uh, they put a lot of effort in this, so that's another one that um, you will see racers and rods there. So we'll be there um, checking out the action and uh, doing what we do, shooting video and and getting some interviews and um, photos and, and that sort of thing. So that's always a always a good time. Um, so let's see uh, another one by our buddy uh, our buddy uh, Jordan. That we will also be uh, be helping um, to uh, um, to host is the domestic violence charity show. This is October twenty seventh. It's going to be a Quaker Steak and Lube, October twenty seventh, which is a Sunday at ten a.m. Uh, Racers and Rods is helping host this. this. Is another one where we'll be there playing DJ and getting media and help coordinating the show and that sort of thing. So it's one of the first ones. Uh, that uh, usually Jordan shows are out in Mulberry, out in the Lakeland area, uh, at a, at a uh, American Legion um, facility uh, out there, which is a, a you know, nice grassy area. But uh, this one, we're coming coming into our stomping grounds, Quaker Steak and Lube, 27th. Um, this will be a good show. Um, it'll bring some of the cars from from up there, crumbly, you know, um, central Central Florida kind of deal. Um, so again, Sunday, uh, October 27th. So that, um, that actually brings us through, um, wow, the end of, uh, I'm just trying to move this out of the way here on the screen. Um, so anyway, that brings us through, through October or through, through yeah, through October, uh, through the end of, 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 uh, uh, what month are we in? <laughs> August, uh, through September. And then uh, all the way through October. So there's a lot of other shows out there. Those are the ones that I have on our calendar that either we are going to be at, um, or that we, um, you know, we 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 know the people. We we would be there if we could. Um, some of that sort of thing. So um, with that, we appreciate everyone being here. We're going to try to do these more often. Again, that'll run us through October, but maybe beginning of October. Or so we'll do. Another refresh of October, and uh, we will do um, on to because I know November and December <laughs> will be uh, will be very very busy uh, times as as always. So um, if you have any questions with anything, let us know. If you have any questions or comments here about what we're doing, about uh, um, our, our videos, um, what you think of the layout here, uh, it's not flashy. Um, but it's, uh, it works. Um, we're, you know, tinkering with stuff. We've got a couple other layouts. We did a test, test video last night. If you happen to see that, that was actually live. Um, that, uh, uh, went pretty well. So we're working on some things. I've got a couple camera situations, got a couple camera cameras here available. Got some different lighting scenarios, got the backdrop here. We've got one of the room. Uh, just with all of my uh, my cool purple and, and blue lights on in the background and that sort of thing. So uh, with that, we appreciate you watching. We hope that you would like, um, comment, and uh, subscribe to everything that we do. Um, we are obviously on 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 Facebook, uh, was which where you could get most of your information. We're also uh, pretty active on Instagram racers and rods there. Um, all of our big videos are posted 
uh, on show videos and, and uh, our, our podcasts will be posted on our YouTube channel. Again, Racers and Rods uh, Media Network, you'll be able to find us there. That'll be pretty easy. Do a little bit on TikTok also. Uh, so we're around. Um, we try to get, get out to, to all the media um, um, outlets as much as we can. So please, 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 if you do not follow us here, uh, if you're not subscribed on the YouTube channel and or uh, Facebook, especially Facebook, because everything that we do on all of the other channels typically is is, is posted on on, uh, on the Facebook channel. So uh, that's where you're going to get the best, most bang for your buck and in, in, in the most of your information. So uh, with that, uh, we're going to sign off here. We appreciate it. Hopefully we see you at some of these shows. Um, if you're interested in them, uh, again, the links will all be down below. And uh, let us know what you might be coming to and, and, and what you're bringing, you know. Um, show us a photo of your car and that sort of thing. If we don't, uh, don't know, we know, know a, a lot of you there. We're, we're, we're creeping up on about 1,000 uh, uh, subscribers here on Facebook. And we're almost to 4,000 on YouTube. So we appreciate everybody's, uh, everybody's support. And uh, we're just going to do more and more. We're going to get bigger and better. And uh, we've got a lot of cool new stuff coming. So for that, we appreciate you watching. Thank you for watching Racers and Rods TV.